I I am doing my final w boss woman workshop um, for for the rest of the year tomorrow, and I was just going over some of the content that I'm going to be talking about with these people, and um, tomorrow's around like a you know personalized blueprint for um, assisting them with nutrition and food education, stress management, and then. Um, how to create a blueprint around their nutrition for their lifestyle, right? I have a very particular way that I do this. I have a fun way that I do it. And um, basically, I teach you how how I would do it, right? So you then have the tools to be able to do it yourself, manage your food yourself. And, um, you know, we're going to be delving into some mindset stuff as well around nutrition, and what's actually going on on a deeper level with that. Anyway, so I just uh, thought I would share a couple of points with you um, on live. And I'm just going to, I've never shared this actually to my group. I wouldn't have a clue how. So, oh, yep. Oh, no. Yeah, I'm not quite sure how to share this. Anyway, maybe able to figure it out sometime soon. Right, so getting to the point of what I want to talk to about to you guys about tonight is actually about using your brain. And I mean this in the most loving, loving and uh, educational, maybe helpful, insightful way. <laughs> Um, using your brain to help you to help with the answers that you are searching for, right? Everybody wants something. We're all working towards something. We, um, you know, we've got dreams and desires and, um, we want more for ourselves. Like that's, that's part of, you know, that's part of being human, right? And once you get to where it is that you want to get to, once you get what you want, you then change the goalpost to go and get um, to then go, oh, I found the share button. Fabulous. You then want something else, right? It's just natural. It's like you get this new, brand new wham, bam thing. And then all of a sudden it sort of gets a bit old and then you want a new thing. And, um, it's just like an ongoing cycle, right? But what's happening is, and I had this amazing conversation with a client of mine today, around um, a program they're doing, right? And it's causing them a lot of stress. It's causing them a lot of, um, they don't really know what's going on. They don't really know what's happening. And, you know, it's got to do with like, they're trying to tra transform their body. Yeah. And um, one second while I just share this. Yeah, my first share. That's amazing. Good. Um, right, so... Anyway, so basically they've gone into this program and it's not exactly what it was that they were after. And it turns out it's like all about food. They thought they were getting mindset and then all of this stuff, right? And um, the thing is, it was just appealing for them to sign up, appealing for them just to, they're like, yep, I'll just do this. The thing is, if we actually just paused for a moment, if we just stepped back for a moment and actually asked ourselves what we truly want. Hey, Tanya, how are you? Good to see you on my live. Um, if we actually paused for a moment, checked in with ourselves and asked ourselves what it is that we truly want. And this is part of what I'll be covering off in my final workshop tomorrow, for those of you who've just joined me. What do you seriously want? And, you know, we talk about what we want all the time, right? And what we want is um, like a future-focused thing, right? We're here and we want this. We're here and we want this. Cool? And most people never, ever bridge that gap. Most people never bridge that gap because they just talk about what it is that they want, but they don't really put the steps in place to support them or guide them to what it is that they want, right? It's just they say they want this and then they do nothing about it. Then there are some people who get pissed off because they're not getting what they want 
and yet they've done nothing about it. So really they don't have a right to get pissed off at themselves. They're just doing it to sabotage themselves or just to kick their ass because that's what they're used to doing. Um, you know, and it can go, everyone can say what they want on a surface level, right? But it's actually about really digging, like, why? Why do you want that? What is it going to mean for you? What is it going to mean for your life? Like, how is it going to change your life? Hey, Shannon, thanks for joining me. What do you want and why? So many people have, like, you know, I ask people every day, like, I've been talking to women flat out. Last last month, I ran like a um, an ad for like the first time. Yeah, go me. And um, you know, I spoke to seventy five women, seventy five women, and I am talking like one percent. There was one woman who knew exactly what it was that she wanted and why and how it would benefit her and what she, it was for the bigger picture. Yeah, she knew exactly what it was that she wanted and why. The other 70 odd people that I spoke to couldn't answer that question. Why? And, you know, like for the purpose of that ad, it was about body, right? And um, for everyone that's joining me, I'm in my bathroom shower. It's because of the lighting. Uh, my lounge room light is horrendous, working on that on the weekend. Um, for most people, like, so for the term of this, it was a body. Hey, Mitch, how you going? Um, it was for the, uh, for the ad was for body. So most people tell me they want to get, you know, they want to lose weight. They want to feel like be healthy. They want to, um, you know, have more energy. Like why, 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 why? You got to scratch the surface and go a level deeper. Right? Otherwise, what value does that have to you? What meaning does that have to you if you don't understand why it is important to you and the impact of how it will actually change your life? Yeah? It's like working on mindset. Like I've just um uh, I just announced it in my boss woman group, but um, I'm really, really excited. I'm just about to launch, or I, I did launch it today, just in my group. Um, uh, my 90 day boss woman unleashed, unleashed ascension program. And it is like amazing, right? And it's all about mindset because so many people don't, you don't know what you don't know until you know it right? It's about educating yourself, understanding yourself, learning about yourself, right? And, um, you know, I'm going on a bit of a tangent here, but like the mind side of things is so important. You know, if you're wanting to change your body, like it starts here. If you want to change your business, you've got to change your mindset for a business mindset, right? For growth and sustainability, if for body, it's about like self-love, well-being, um, you know, and also um, oh, the word like body image, you know, aesthetics. Um, you know, if you want to better your relationship, it's the same thing. It all starts here, right? And it's about scratching the surface to go a level deeper. And most people are just sitting on the surface floating around like... Yeah, I want this, I want this, I want that, I want this. Yet they've got no idea how they're currently operating in the world, no idea how their unconscious behaviors are affecting them and their current reality. Um, they've just got, there's got no idea, right? And, you know, for some people that's cool, yeah? Some people that's cool. Like a lot of people spend their whole life saying they want something and they never get it, right? And then they die wishing that they had done something to do it. Or, you know, I can't tell you how many people like of an older age I speak to are like, Fuck, I wish I just went for it. I wish I just did that. Or I wish I did that. You know, I'm not one of those people. I'm not going to get to the age of 80 and then say, I wish I had done that. Again, a little bit of a tangent. Um, but just bringing it back to the focus of the video of what I'm talking about is like, use your brain. 
when you're trying to find these answers, right? So if there's something that you want, why? What is it going to mean to you? Like, how is this going to impact your world? How is it going to change your life? Like, how is it going to make you a better person? How is it going to, um, you know, lift your vibration? How is it going to create more energy for you? How is it going to bring more space into your life? Like, these are the sorts of questions that you m might want to ask yourself when you are going for something. Hey, Ashley, how you going? Um, you know, and what do you need, right? So it's like, what do you want? Why do you want it? What do you need? Do you need support? Do you need guidance? Do you need someone to hold your hand? Do you need just a set out plan? Do you need to do a, hey, Warren, how you going? Do you need to map it out with somebody who's already there or who's been there or who could teach you something, right? What do you actually need to support you to get you from where you are right now to where you want to be or what it is that you say that you're wanting? What is it that you need? Right? Ask yourself this question. What is it that I need to get, um, you know, a six-figure a six figure business. What is it that I need to better myself, to show up better in my relationships? Like, what kind of support do I need? What do I need to get my banging body for summer, right? Or, you know, what do I need to lose my 50 kilos? I had this conversation with a lady last week. You know, she's wanting to lose 50, 60-odd kilos, and, and, and I'll put it back on her, right? She gave me a, like a very simple um, explanation. If she just did this, then this, this, and this. Like, you didn't get to 60 kilos overweight or just like that, right? It's a series of events, decisions, and choices that have to do with up here. It's a series of those events and choices and decisions and how you've been perceiving life, what's going on in your head. It's a series of those that have led you to be 60 kilos overweight or however overweight you are or, you know, I don't know, however skinny you are and you want to put on weight, whatever, right? All, all of that is based on the current person that you are operating as, right? So when you go to lose, I'll just use the same example. When you go to lose 50, 60 kilos, there's a lot of like warped up stuff going on in your brain. There is a, you know, there is a lot of um, limiting beliefs, decisions, um, fears. Uh, there is so much going on in your mind and your brain, right? And you've you're in this comfortable space. So what kind of support do you need to help you make this huge shift, this trans, like transformative shift? Like what do you need to ascend from where you are right now to where you want to be? And most people do not think about this, right? Um, I have coach, like I have support. I have coaches. I have a healing coach. Like I have a body coach, yeah? It depends on what's going on in my life, right? And what I'm choosing to focus on. I get, I get my pillars. I get my foundation. I get my base, right? I get those steady so that I can then easily with flow and work my way through challenges that arise along the way. But I can do this without having to, I can do this without just having to do it alone. Like, why are we trying to do it all alone? Like, we are not experts in everything. Yeah, and sometimes we just don't want to have that responsibility for that area of our life right now. Right? It's, um, you know... Or sometimes we just want some support in certain areas of life. Or sometimes we want to take it to the next level, yet we don't know how. So we find somebody that will teach us how. And it's really important to know what it is exactly that you want so that when you do go to get guidance or support from a coach um, or from anything really, 
that you will know when you, you will know if that person or that business or that whatever resonates with you because it ticks the criteria of what it is that you're looking for and what it is that you need, right? And then it's just about putting one foot in front of the other and walking your way to get there. You know, so many of us are um, diving or jumping in and diving and just doing it without even using our brains. There's so many people just like not using your brain. This is such a, an easy and simple thing that you can actually sit with before you make some of these decisions um, with the things that you're wanting or wanting to change, right? I mean, if you don't need any guidance or support, then cool. Like, what are you doing? Go get it. Like, move it already. If you know what to do, like, go do it. What's stopping you? Yeah? And then if there is something stopping you, what is it? And who do you need to help you to remove that so you can keep moving forward yourself? Some really, really like insightful information into how I operate. Hey, George, how you going? Um, some really, yeah, insightful information to um, how my brain works, how you could get your brain to work and in your favor, right? This is for your benefit. Stop wasting time. Stop stuffing around. Like, stop fluffing around. Like, wakey, wakey. Like, wake up. Yeah? Use your brain and use the information. Hey, Subi, how are you? You're just coming on to the end of my video. So, I'm like, I'm getting real fierce right now. But I am encouraging... Um, just watch the video from the start. And yes, I am in my bathroom. It's because the lighting in my lounge room is horrendous and you can't see me. So I figured out, what the hell? I'll sit on my bath. <laughs> um, right, so the point to this video and just summing this up is, hey, Travis, how are you going? Use your brain. I just gave you simple questions or things that you can think about to check in with yourself before you make it, like when you're making a decision as to like what it is that you want um, and how you're going to get it. Like be smart, work smarter, not harder. So many people are just like busting their asses, doing diet after diet, um, coaching program after coaching program, this and that, this and that. And they're all searching for the answers. If you actually just stopped to check in with yourself and got clear on these elements that I've just spoken about, then you can save yourself A, a lot of time, B, a lot of money, C, a lot of energy and space, um, and you can just get smarter about what it is about this whole, like what it is that you say that you're wanting. And honestly, if you keep saying that you want something and you're doing nothing about it, like get that the hell off your want list. Like stop talking about it. Seriously, just stop talking about it. Because if you're not willing to do something about it, if you're not open to do something about it, like, stop talking about it because you're just making yourself feel like shit and you're just feeling disappointed all the time because you're not getting somewhere that you want to be, yet you're not actually putting the effort and the energy and the work in to get there. So just, like, stop talking about it if that is you. Um, it's probably not you if you're, um, if you're watching this video still at the end, right? Um, so, obviously... Um, yeah, that's my point. Like, take it on board. Give me some feedback. Give me some opinions. I'd love to know what you think or what your approach is or even tell me what it is that you want. Like, comment it below. Like, let's work through this process. I mean, do it publicly on this feed. I'm more than happy to do that. Um, or what you can do is I've got a couple of spaces on the weekend. Hey, Lauren. Um, to I've got a couple of spaces on the weekend to actually have a call um, with anyone that is open and willing to work on themselves, right? 
Um, you know, I've got the three programs that I have just launched, which is my 90 day boss woman unleashed ascension program. I also have that in a group scenario as well. So I've got private one-to-one -one mentoring and group. Hey James, how are you? Thanks for joining me. You guys are right at the end. So you're going to have to go back to the start. Um, and I also have my retreat coming up in February, which I'm mega excited about. And um, so I have all those options, right? If you are open and willing to work on yourself, right? Just reach out. That's what I'm here for. That's why I do my videos. That's why I put myself out here and why I am so extremely passionate about what it is that I do and I'm talking about. So um, yeah, that's it. Reach out if you like, comment below, and um, I will catch you guys real soon. Okay, thanks for listening. And thanks for being in my bathroom. <laughs> Bye.